An MBTA Transit Authority officer accused of excessive force, and the Suffolk County DA is now launching a criminal investigation. Officer Nicholas Morrissey is accused of dragging a black man off a bus, kneeling on his back, and shoving his face into the ground. Good evening to you. I'm David Wade. And I'm Lisa Hughes. DA Rachel Rollins is vowing to get to the bottom of what happened. WBZ's Liam Martin joins us now live in studio with the breaking details. Liam? Well, Lisa and David, the incident happened back on April 28th, and the DA says surveillance video from the scene does not match Morrissey's story. District Attorney Rollins says that Officer Nicholas Morrissey allegedly dragged a homeless and intoxicated man from an MBTA bus at Forest Hills, forcibly holding the 63 year old face down with the knee on his back for 20 seconds, pushing his head into the pavement. The officer also allegedly then dragged him out of the bus lane. The man was not seriously hurt. However, the DA says that Morrissey filed a report alleging that the man had lost his balance while trying to spit on him and then fell and hit his head as Morrissey tried to redirect him. The DA says that report is not consistent with the video. In a statement from MBTA General Manager Steve Poftak to WBZ, the T says the alleged events as described are contrary to the core values and mission of the MBTA and its police department. Transit police officers receive specialized training in de-escalation techniques and are expected to treat riders with dignity and respect at at all times. Now, Morrissey resigned before facing any termination proceedings. His supervisor has been placed on administrative leave. David and Lisa.